Math 31, I had a question coming out of section 2.2, number 45. And this is where we were given two sets of ordered pairs, and we were asked to determine if the slope of the lines that pass through those pairs of points are parallel or perpendicular. So let me just write off to the side here for number 45. The first ordered set of ordered pairs we've got was negative 1 and 3, and then that got paired up with 5 and 1. And then the second set of ordered pairs we got was negative 2 and 3, and that got paired up with the point 0, 9. Now, for both of these sets of ordered pairs, so for this first set here, actually, let me use a different color. So for this first set here, all right, and then this second set here, I'm going to find the slope of the lines between them, and the formula I'm going to use is always y2 minus y1 over x2 minus x1. So for example, in this first slope calculation, you see me subtracting the y coordinates here, right? I did 1 minus 3. And then I also went and I subtracted or put that in ratio to the difference of the x coordinates. And when I simplified that slope, I found out that slope was negative 1 third. Now if I go over to my second set of ordered pairs, I'm going to subtract the y coordinates. So I've got 9 and 3. In the numerator, I'm also going to subtract the x coordinates. So I've got 0 and negative 2. And I'm, I'm staying consistent in the direction. And, and what I mean by that was I did 9 minus 3, and then I did 0 minus negative 2. Now you could have gone the other way also. You could have gone this direction, right? I, could, I know there's a lot of arrows. I could have gone this direction. I just need to stay consistent. But anyways, for that second set of ordered pairs, once I simplify the slope, it's 3. And if we look at the slope of my first line, which was negative 1 third, and the slope of the second line, or at least the line between those two points being 3, these are negative reciprocals of one another. And when lines have slopes that are negative reciprocals of one another, the lines are perpendicular. On the flip of that, if the slopes were the same, like if this slope was negative 1 third and this one was also negative 1 third, then the slopes would be parallel. All right, thanks so much, everyone. Bye.